Welcome everyone. Today we are doing an unboxing and intro to the DB Journeys Savage Bike Bag. So this is actually how the bike carrier uh, gets shipped to you. This is just pulled directly out of, out of the shipping box. And this is how it comes. And this is actually how it'll look like when it is, uh, when you're storing it. So this is how it folds down. And let's get it opened up. So here it is wide open. You've got your directions here. Strip the bike, attach the bike to block, <laughs> you know. So um, this is actually really cool. I probably won't go through the whole process and details of how it gets put together. So that's actually one thing I like about this, uh, this bag from DB Journey. Let me find the tag on here. Travel redefined. The journey starts at douchebags.com. So this is the Savage bike bag. Pretty cool, check them out. There'll be a link in the description for a discount code. Uh, I'm not sure what it is, 10 or 15%. But one thing I do like about this, and I'll talk a little bit once I get it put together, is this actually has a hard metal frame that actually uh, gives this bag the integrity um, and protection for your bike. So it's not just a full soft cover, soft case. The assembly is pretty easy and straightforward. The side supports will go up fully after you get your bike into the center and mount it. Then the top silver bars will hook in and get the final straps attached. But since I won't be traveling with this until later in the year, a full demo of installing your bike will come then. In the meantime, these are photos from their website. So in here, these clips here, these can be, these can be popped out. It's like, it looks like this here. And so you'll be able to place that so it can fit your bike however you need it to go. And so this will pop out. This is for your fork protector. So your fork will go in here. You'll place this up front. This image here is how you prep your bike and getting it attached to the block. This is what it looks like before it goes into the bag. The block under the bottom bracket and the fork protector clip onto the rails in the bike bag. There are also a designated pockets for your pedals and wheels for added protection. The teardown process is also simple and quick to do. The framing is lightweight and it folds into itself to allow for a smaller footprint for storing away easily when it's not in use, which also comes in handy when you're traveling with the bag and maybe staying in a hotel room with limited space. With the bike bag fully assembled, you have a tough outer layer which appears to be very durable for wear and tear. There are heavy duty pockets for grabbing the bag on both sides of the bag as well as two straps on top. The spinning wheels on one side uh, with the fixed wheels in the rear allow for easy maneuvering and gives you options for multiple ways to carry or pull this around. I know this isn't extremely in-depth, but there's not a whole lot to cover right now with this unboxing. It's got a built-in lightweight frame, designated pockets for pedals, wheels, and multiple layers of protection for not only your frame, but the forks and handlebars as well. If you want a bag to fully protect your bike, this is the bag you're looking for. Stay tuned for my trip out west later in the year where I'll give a full breakdown of what it's like to travel with this bag. Thanks for watching.